Now. All right, here we go, grand finals. Grand finals, Spark. If you like Lord Knight, make some noise. What about Spark? <laughs> Massive crowd favoritism for Spark in this case. It seemed, Lord Knight is I'm not sure why winners. everyone loves Spark, even though Lord Knight sent him to set Tokita losers himself. But, you know, whatever. Maybe people just love to see Spark just block everything. I think so, yeah. I definitely think he's a crowd favorite with his low tier character, Hawkerman. That's right. And now we're getting right into it. Now, Laichi just applying pressure immediately. Like combo. Laichi has a good, a decent matchup against Hawkerman in this version. In previous versions, Hawkerman's counters were very strong against against Laichi. But Was in that this a fuzzy guard he hit him with just now? I'm not sure. It may have been. But. Like Goes for the cross under overhead, that was sick. It was very dirty. Wow, getting his staff back for a nice staff combo. Lord Knight always has his plans ready. He's a very setup oriented player and, can, and is very good once he gets his plan going. Spark already on the ropes. Good die. No! Why did he do that? See, as I said, Huckerman can counter those mix ups, yes. and which is why he used to have a very good advantage. But now, it is a little bit different as his damage is much lower than Lychee's. Lord Knight, I mean, uh, Spark trying to run it in here. Spark can do it with his seven orbs. He can definitely make a comeback. Blocks on Tatsu. Very nice with five jab, throw. Jab throw. Very nice. Otaru fatals him out of his Dai Sharin. Great damage. Now he's on the ropes. Very nice. Forces him to burst. Lord Knight says, I got this. Trying to burst. Yeah, Spark. Spark cut is running his back. He cut that. Projectile making the ore, forcing Lord Knight to run into it. Very smart move by Spark. Very, very good play by Spark. Very nice overhead hit, forcing a counter hit. Hawkman's frame traps are very strong. Yes, most of his aromas are actually plus on block, but he has no chains, unlike other characters. Hatsu is punishable, gets punished for it. Solid punishment. Very nice punish by Spark. Getting in there, but misses his normal. Blocks the cross up. Very nice. Wow. That nor that attack is normally very high plus frames on block, but the second hit whip allowing Spark to attack. Very nice delaying his air momentum by Lord Knight, able to attack. Very nice. Blocks that rising overhead. Spark is just too good at defense. I do not think he could have blocked that on reaction this so fast. Play of both players having good reads at this point. Very nice with 5 8 to throw. Very great. Now, very nice overhead hit. Goes for the low. Blocks his great DP. Do you, you see that? So even though the uppercut comes back down, if you hit Lychee on the right frame, it will turn back into a stick and will not hit you. It takes tons of guts to do that. That's incredible. Because that staff on the way back down does over a thousand damage. And it is the majority of the damage of that attack. Now Spark does need to win two sets to win all of EVO. However, Spark with that showing is showing us that this may be possible with his skill. Wow, catches that with normal with the throw. Beats that back dash. Spark overwhelming Lord Knight right now. Fatals him right out of his uppercut. That was an amazing read. This is gonna do a lot of damage. A ton of damage for Spark. Overhead. Stopping down on his target again. Lord Knight just cannot block it, Throw. gets thrown. This is it for this round. Lord Man. Knight looking completely defenseless at this point, unable to do anything at all. Spark is just showing us how strong he is. I believe that because Lord Knight is such a setup oriented player, he may have a lot of trouble with Spark, who is so good at downloading. That's right. Hotaru's him right out of it. Another big fat combo Spark is for just Spark. everything he's doing. Oh, forcing an air attack, gets another throw. Lord Knight unable to do anything, almost gets his burst baited. Nice rising jump B. Spark is just going in there, gets another burst. Lord Knight looking incredibly free. Two games in a row. Oh Spark my goodness, almost, almost double perfected by Spark. It seems Spark. that first round where Lord Knight almost won. The download was completed in that first round. In that round. first round. You're hitting me. It does not matter. I will come back and beat you at everything you do. That's right. That is how Spark is showing us right now. 
Lord Knight still looking relatively calm, thinks he could turn it around regardless. Lord Knight is stone-faced right now, but Spark looks very confident. Spark, Spark still with his normal Spark face, which is what I like to call his face where I cannot even tell what he's thinking. The Robo-Alex face. That is right. That, now that 5A hits only only Hockerman and Tager crouching, and it's one a very good pressure tool against Hockerman, but was not able to make much out of it. Uncrashable 5A is a very strong tool in this game. That's right. Blocks it. Now that has a lot of block stun as opposed to previous games where I had almost none. Very nice throw setup. Lord Knight hit me with that in tournament also. I've seen him hit everyone with that Pretty throughout much. all of the top eight so far. It is very difficult to see and block. That flying staff is just too much of a distraction. Now we're going into Dai Sharin. Will he make the correct choice here? Okay, he did. He Bates waited. the counter out. Very nice, makes himself an orb. Now, the other benefit to cutting projectiles Sunset. is that you build tons of meter. Spark pressure, very okay. strong. Spark fearless, going in there. Very nice counter hit B. Sends him to the corner. He's out of meter, but he's able to get him to the corner. This is his counter, but unable to punish. Nice frame trap. Staff messes up the combo, but it's another frame trap. Throw reject miss setup. Jumps right over that attack. The E2A does not catch. Spark doing Sparks pressure. Offense good. Very nice overhead stomp. Gets a pickup combo. That's right. If you do not hit a button to tech, you will get picked out. up. Guy Sharon countered most likely. Yes, that's right. Just chops that projectile right out. Spark with good defense, but forced to burst. He wants to win this round regardless of the time limit left. Spark could do it with a good hit. Guy Sharon will make it very difficult though. Three seconds. Makes an orb. Oh. Can't do oh, oh, he gets the hit in. Oh. He manages to hit him right before the Spark round the ended. Victory. Spark, one round away from resetting this set. Gets another oh. counter. Oh my goodness. Spark is showing so much strength right now. Box set. Oh my goodness. Counter hit 2C. 2C almost Fails makes that burst. The burst though. That 2C is such a high guess attack, but he manages to catch him out of it. Spark is so good at reading people and with good defense. Spark blocked him so well. Has lots of frame advantage on block now. Oh, catches that Kishu. Kishu does not have low invincibility, which is why he got caught. Right, blocks all those rising overheads. Spark with Iron amazing wall. defense. Breaks, Breaks the throw the even. Wow, Kishu Emma. Him. Spark just does not care yeah, about Spark what he does. It's so up there right now. Spark can definitely win it completely. Just with sitting there waiting. Spark, come to me. Spark is content to block as he is building meter just by waiting. And with eight orbs, he can do massive damage. Oh, he gets red. Choose first, first, gets completely baited. Spark. The bracket Spark. is now reset. Lord Unbelievable Knight. play by Spark. Resets yes. the bracket with three straight victories. Crowd is chanting Spark. Everybody chanting Spark. Everyone from everywhere is chanting Spark right now. They totally are completely impressed with Spark's method of play. Lord Knight now thinking of switching to Makoto. He's talking amongst themselves right now. Crowd telling Lord Knight not to do it. Lord Knight is, if you'll excuse me, mind fudged and does not. This just is like, I can't do anything against this guy. I don't know what to do. He doesn't feel like Lychee can bring it home, I suppose. Yeah, it seems like it. Sparks defense, offense, and his reads are just amazing right now. As he's shown in that matchup, he is able to completely dominate Lord Knight's Night G. So Lord Knight taking his time to think about it. It is not he is not sure whether he wants to risk Makoto, but he does. He chooses to do it. Chooses to go to Makoto. This may be a really bad mistake. Right, here we go. First to three. First to three. Now Makoto does have that Hakuman only combo, giving him the advantage. But it may not be enough, as he may not have the muscle memory for it. Now, as we know, Spark was able to defeat Hartnana very convincingly, so I do not know if this is a good choice at all. Right there. The interrupt. Spark with guts, interrupting at a place that is potentially unsafe, but gets a combo for it. Another counter hit. Now he knows about Makoto's counter. Fails to cross under. Now Spark with the lead. Waiting. Whoa, very nice cross under. 
even with Makoto, Lord Knight is very scared right now. Wow! Spark getting a throw. Lord Knight not able to defend himself at all. Whoop misses his 2C. Whoop gets a throw. Ducks under that 5B. Very risky. Bait. Counter assault to get out. That's right. Lord Knight very scared. He can't do much right now. Gets a nice low hit. His play style is very different from Hart Nana's. So he may be able to use that to his advantage. I don't know if that will be enough to pull it out though. Gets a good, co Gets a good combo showing us that he can do combos. Makes the orb short, remembering that, oh wait, I can't do this on him. That's right. Very nice reset. Blocks that crouching low. Wow, gets hit by it. Breaks, Breaks the throw. throw. Very nice. Emma. Wow. That's suddenly even again. Spark with a tiny lead. Tons of meter. Spark could be content to wait now. Nice. That was an amazing. Amazing Hotaro. Instant blocks and interrupts his string with Hotaro. Invincible on startup. So, so strong. Very nice overhead. overhead. Oh, Bates the gets upper red. Forces the burst. That 5C starter does massive damage even mid screen for Hakuman. Very nice interrupt. The more Lord Knight staggers his strings, the more opportunities that Hakuman gets in order to instant block. And as he instant blocks, he builds insane amounts of meter. That's right. Very nice read. Jumps right out of it, forces a second burst from Lord Knight. Lord Knight now in trouble of losing this round very convincingly. Overhead. Trying to not pressure. Not really sure what to do. Trying to pressure, trying to turn this around. Blocks his overhead, blocks his low. Blocks his overhead yet again, forces an RC. The iron wall. Unable to do anything. Gets yeah, overhead, but not. Converted. Oh my goodness. Finally, Finally gets him with a frame trap. Misses his dash to see. Gets throw a throw, reject. reject. Oh, he's going to have to put in some work right now if he wants to take this back. Too nervous to land that throw combo. Santetsu gets uppercutted. That's a good uppercut, but drops a combo. Oh, gets very the nice. Blatant overhead. That was good. Lightning arrow. Shooting star. Ta. Ah. All right, drop this combo. <laughs> oh, Santetsu. Santetsu does not get blocked. Santetsu is one of those overheads that is like, you must block me or you will die. That's right. It is not that fast, but if you fail to block it, you are done. That's right. Notice how every time it hits someone, you see them burst immediately. Immediately, it's like, I don't want this. Yeah. I do not want this at all. One of the few moves I've seen in the entire game that pe makes people absolutely positively burst yeah. if they ever see it That's hit. right. Now, Lord Knight choosing to go back to Lychee, I think, which is definitely more solid choice. He knows this character much better. Even if Spark has him downloaded, he could just change his style a little bit and see if he can pull it out from there. Maybe that one game is all he needed to adjust to bring it back. Maybe, maybe. Lord Knight is a very strong player. That is right. He has the will to win and he can do it. But he now has a little bit of a disadvantage. This time he's choosing to Using Lychee's good neutral game at this point, but Spark is still just content to wait. That's right. Spark is okay with waiting because he's progressing his gameplay just by standing there. He gains meter and it lets him do more damage. That very nice jump beam. Very nice combo by Spark. Very nice combo. Great combo. Very nice. Blatant throw, that was good. That was very good. Bad Makes burst. burst. That's a very bad place to burst. Yes. Here he is. Shupu may finish it, but he Tries misses the combo. Down. Double throws. Wow, nice. Wrap it up. Otaru oh, does not finish not? him. Looking for that two-way hit. Any random hit. Lord Knight not content to lose. Throws standing B. Cross Tries for the cross-up, it fails. Spark just throwing that A out there. Spark not moving at all. Yeah, this He's time Lord Knight taking the initiative with an overhead. He needs to pull it out. Stabs come back. Trying to put, trying to force Spark to do something against another overhead. Spark unable to see this overhead twice in a row. Gets hit by another combo. Very nice 4,000 damage combo into Dai Sharon if he chooses to. Dai Sharon, here it comes. Good damage and a good wake up. Wow. Sends it backwards to try to bait the counter out. That's right. Yukikaze gets baited. Lord Knight working on a perfect here. And Spark turned it around. He's shown us that he can. Wow, he bursts. That is very gutsy. I went out of his to burst. I oh, guess good lord. He's just styling. He's just like, I don't need this burst. I want to win this round. 
because I have you red. Now Lord Knight is trying to is thinking about bursting. Lord Knight wants to win this with that burst so he could be even for next round, but if he does, he may end up losing the round to his burst safe combos. Or since he gets out of there. Very, very nice counter assault. Now with only two orbs left. Very nice hot suit. Very nice confirmed. Lord Knight showing us that he's not totally free just yet. He wants to win this very badly. Very oh capable. no! AC gets baited out at the beginning. Blatant throw on wake up. So Bates I mean, the baited, fails but to punish it. too far. Random throw. Very good pressure from Lord Knight right now. Lots of standing jabs. Very nice throw. Time to see a throw. Wow, nice combo from Lord yes. Knight. Very strong combo here for Lord Knight. Thumb throw, almost 3,000 damage plus Daisharin. Which way will it go? Goes for the hit setup. Oh, misses his throw. Like he's supposed Not to. Not confident in his wake up to get Oh scarred. no! And that's why right there. Basically, that setup, you're supposed to hit him with it and then throw him. And it forces him to air tag. Wow! wow. Nice red air throw. Interesting. It is throw reset. Standing A, this will wrap it up and he doesn't burst. He needs he to find a safe place to, Bad place to burst. Yep. If you do not Ooh. burst early, you cannot burst at all. Spark is one game away from resetting, from just winning taking the whole Taking everything, tournament. taking this entire tournament and taking all that glorious, glorious money. Lauren needs to find some way to turn this around. But Spark's momentum is just incredible, even as just a defensive character. Five games in a row, I believe it's been. That is right. Lorna has yet to win a single match at all against Spark. Getting him. The overhead. Will he convert it? Yes. He does. Solid combo in the corner by Lord Knight. Spark so he did good damage, about 30% in the wake ups. That's right. Getting another Dai Sharin. Yes. That's right. Which will it be? Oh, Counters no. It. Took the risk. It's it's still good because Malachi can no longer mix you up if that happens, basically. You can just counter him and she'll be forced to fall down and you get the free damage. That's right. Lord Knight, kind of pensive, not sure what to do. Very nice. He realized that Spark is having trouble blocking that and is content to use it. Santis gets blocked. Renka. Renka for safety. Very nice. Wow, Renka 4D. So good. Wow, had more hesitation, but this time blocks the 4D very cleanly. 5A anti-air, that was good. That was quite risky, but totally worth it when he got it. Wow! Whoa, Price what? The throw. Tsubamegaishi. Counter hit, hit jump B. B. Very nice combo. Very Sick nice combo. combo by Spark. Spark, I believe, may just might as well be the best Hakuman in the world. Face his burst yet Unbelievable. again. Unbelievable. You just cannot burst against this man unless you absolutely know that he cannot beat it. Spark is one round away from beating Fortnite. Crowd chanting Spark. Clean. Everyone loving PNW. Fortnite throw by Lord Knight. Let's see if he can make some magic happen here. Misses his falling Hatsu. Lots of stand jabs. Doesn't, Finally hits with an overhead. But the staff was returning, couldn't capitalize properly. Blocks Tries overhead. again, doesn't work. Yuki Kaze! Oh, it's a nice combo regardless. Air throw. Air throw. Nice combo Very by nice Lord combo, Lord Knight. Chun, Dai Sange. What does it say? Gets a combo, Dai Sharin. Which it's setup him. will it be? I think it's the combo. The, yeah, the air throw setup. See, it forces him to block immediately. Very nice. Lord Knight not willing to go home just yet. Getting another hit confirmed. Lord Knight still has a burst, plenty of meter. But will he be able to use it? If Goes he gets his another. wake up right, Spark is over. He's done. He got it. Very nice. Lord Knight not wanting to go home at all. Lord Knight trying to turn it around. He's got to build momentum. He has to take this game. There is no choice. You must take it or go home. Very Four nice. 4D oh, still nice. hits Spark. He may have discovered Spark's weakness, which is that overhead was not a very obvious animation. Spark 
needs to needs to conform and figure out how to block it. Spark blocking does not block Excellent. the fuzzy. Early now, jumping 2C into low jabs. Back very nice. Get away. Throw Makes the air throw. Off. After air throw, Sparks jumping C is very commanding normal. Can't really do anything after it. Yes, that's why both of them. Oh, another hit for another hit for Spark. Sending Lord Knight to the corner. Throw. Purple throw mix up. Ooh. Counter hits trade. Spark kind of taunting a little bit. Trying to get Lord Knight to do something. Oh, catch him out of a back dash. Back dash. Gold Gold burst gets faded. Oh, Taru! This is probably it. This is over. Mark can do this combo. It's over. He will be your evil champion. Extending his combo. It's over. Spark is the winner. Spark takes it. Spark is your Evolution 2011 Blaze Group Grand Finals champion. He Spark. takes home all the basics. Spark. 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 Crowd chanting Spark. Spark. Everyone Spark. loving Spark. 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 Loving his defensive and offensive gameplay. I've never seen such a dominating victory by Spark. I have never seen such amazing play, period. Uh, I have not even watched a Japanese Hawkman do so well. Came all the way out of losers to win.